Thursday. Hey, thanks, everybody. That's a wrap. Vlog number four. Oh, I got your face. Cool. This vlogging stuff is uh, its really weird to sit in front of the camera every morning or every afternoon. Not every afternoon. It's really weird to do this. It's uh, a little bit awkward. I know I'm gonna be glad I did it. It felt weird when I did it with day one with Lane all the way back in the day. I was in a meeting yesterday and I pulled out my calendar. Baby do. I saw a baby do right there. It's just right there. And so it can happen any second. It could happen today. The process could be starting right now. I saw this thing on probably Reddit a few months ago. And so I've been keeping this life calendar. It was a really cool idea. Let me find it. The way it works is this. In the upper right hand corner, put your birthday. And you have 52 squares that go across. Each square represents a week. And then as, as time tracks, you mark progress points, at least for me. Different different squares have different meanings, different like blackout here, I've got dots here. I've got uh, age 20, this is right here is 1997. This is 2007, 1987, 1977. On up all the way down to 2067 when I'll be 90 years old. So what I need to do is catch this up to, what's today? The 16th. So I've, I haven't done it for like a month and a half. So it's time to fill it out. It keeps me in the now. It keeps me realizing how quickly time is passing. We're only two boxes away from the actual due date. So that's pretty crazy. Uh, Mother's Day. We had a great Mother's Day. Homemade gifts were made. Uh, breakfast in bed was made. Uh, we did an awesome family photo. By looking at this sheet and seeing, wow, my whole life is represented in this. Time is really short for when baby's going to make an appearance. We finally get to meet him. Super ready. Super, super ready. Jamie's, uh, I'm watching. I'm seeing signs. Things are changing. Things are, are getting different. I can't think of a better example of a mom. An example of a mother that I, I just, I, I haven't seen it. She's the best mom I've ever seen. And I can't believe that after having seven, she's, she wants to have one with me. After seven, after seven, she, uh, she wanted to have a baby with me. She wanted to create life with me. And she wants to raise this baby with me and we're going to do it together. I'm looking forward to helping him navigate life and feelings and emotions and deciphering things and understanding intentions and being free to, to be who he is and let him uh, explore everything. I can't wait to see the look on his face when he does things for the first time. It's like, yeah, Mother's Day. Can't wait to eat my son. I can't wait to watch Jamie love him and care for him the way that she does her other kids and she does my kids. We did a photo shoot with Jolene, a maternity boudoir photo shoot. Watching Jolene work with Jamie and encouraging her, she just pulled the beauty out. Jamie doesn't feel super great right now. I don't think any pregnant woman does. Yeah, wearing a backpack all day hurts. Carrying a camera around all day at a wedding or, or anything, I like I get really sore and tired, but doing it 24 seven for nine months, Jamie is beautiful. She's a beautiful mother. She's a beautiful woman. Uh, she's a beautiful partner. She's a, she's a beautiful mom. So happy Mother's Day. Even though this is late, happy Mother's Day. The Mother's Day vlog. <laughs> Boudoir photo shoot. Done crying. Done.